okay, this this thought will change your mind, right? Okay. So imagine, imagine like a bird shits on your arm, shit right? Your arm, right? No, I don't want to imagine that. Okay, imagine that though. No. Would you use? Wait, what happens after like <laughs> you use it sprays water at your butt? Do you like put your pants back on while it's dripping? Well, yes. Turum. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Hey. Oh. Premium two ply. That's so wasteful. You gotta you gotta cut those in half nowadays. I actually have it. <laughs> I've been doubling on my supply by using one ply at a time, but it's messy. Your fingers go through the toilet paper with one ply. Um, let's keep going. <laughs> you know the one, the one, uh, one toilet paper technique. Uh, tell me more about this one paper technique. <laughs> you have to Google it to find out. <laughs> Is that actually a thing? A few moments later. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what, Are you... what is that? All right, boys. You know what we're doing today. What are you doing the bidet? today? Stop with the bidet, bro. <laughs> I have for you guys eight survival products you would need in a time of crisis. We are in a time of crisis. Please tell me more. I am in a crisis right now. I'm about to lose my mind. Jason says, I am crisis. <laughs> 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 On to the first one. Straw. Life straw personal water filter. It looks like a straw. Do you like water? I like water. It's an award-winning Lifestuff water filter. It's a must-carry tool for hiking, camping, travel, and emergencies. No disaster kit is complete without it. I don't have a disaster kit. Look how many ratings this has. 15,000. <laughs> I've seen crap. so many tests of this online where people drink like their own urine and stuff. It really works. Well, in the photo, there's a guy <laughs> literally drinking. He's drinking off, off of a river. He's really failing at the social distancing thing. If someone takes their shit in the toilet, and you stick it in there, can you suck out the slush? <laughs> oh. Oh, God. Yo, there, there's a video. The guy is literally just drinking off of the river, straight up. Okay, well, it seems to be working. So from what I see, you just open it, you put it in a river, and you suck dirty water, and then it becomes nice water. You can transform 4,000 liters. One of, one of these tiny things. That's more water than the average person drinks in a year. Odd question, but it's on my mind. If I pee into a bowl and use the filter on that, will it taste like water or pee? <laughs> Alright, and this guy says salt and urea, along with various other substances your body is trying to eliminate, will remain in the filtered urine, so it will taste like pee. Whatever that tastes like. Oh, oh god. It, this doesn't work on urine, guys. Yo, there's a buy use the option. Oh, Wait, you... what? <laughs> if you want to save a dollar, you can buy used. Is it a buy? Or is it a pass? Hmm. You know, water is actually very important in a crisis. So I think that's a cop. So I think that's actually a cop as well. All right. Holy, Holy shit. shit. <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> is that a joke? It's a survival tool. Oh my God. Can you imagine? Like, oh, hold on guys. I got my tool right here. You're trying to dissect this thing and finding what you need. <laughs> oh my God. It's 10 grand. Wait, what? This is 10,000. Holy shit. And how does it have 572 reviews? Holy shit. Look at the list from the manufacturer. It has 87 uh, things. Like, <laughs> it has everything. Wait, is that a compass on the end there? <laughs> yeah, it has a compass. It has a saw. All types of screwdrivers you can ever imagine. It has a plier. Different types of pliers. <laughs> Wait, there's a question here. He's about to spend $10,000 on a knife. And the only thing he's thinking about, can it core an apple? <laughs> like, what? <laughs> can we see a photo of this knife in the closed position? You can in about 100 years. <laughs> how long it takes to close each and every one of these two. <laughs> Is there a wenger in your pocket? Or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> I don't see how the two things are mutually exclusive. It is a wanger in my pocket and I am happy to see you. <laughs> so far, I've only opened about half of the things on it and taped it to a Roomba. It's been <laughs> making small repairs around my home while I know. <laughs> it even has a toothpick. Can you imagine <laughs> you're cleaning your teeth with this? So is this a buy or a pass? This is a hard Burn. pass. <laughs> For $10,000? I think I think that's a pass. Pretend you, you had 10000 to spare. I would buy a car. That's true. That is true. I would buy a lot of toilet paper. What is that? Oh. It's called a grappling hook. 33 feet. 
That sounds pretty far, actually, isn't it? The second picture looks different from the first one. There's a there's a photo here that shows that it can go from a gravity hook to a grappling hook in one minute. You can pull your car with it. You can pick things up. You can climb a tree. You can open a, a bottle. If you look at the pictures in the uh, the reviews, you see there's this guy. He's he's holding on to a tree. But I don't know how much I would like trust, trust that. <laughs> <laughs> look at this. This one's using it to outdoor cook. I guess it lifts the pot up over a fire. Oh, it looks a lot smaller in that photo. Loading capacity, 800 pounds. Okay. <laughs> it weighs one pound, but it can hold up to 800 pounds. It's like you're using it like a claw machine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He literally lifted like, a whole shovel with it. And then he, you attach the second segment to it, the second piece, and it becomes a grappling. It's $27, right? Yeah, I think we would definitely cop this. This is sick. If you're bored at home, you can start throwing this at your wall. I would get it. <laughs> That's the Mountain Men's Three Wolf short sleeve tee, the one in the in the last video, the review. So how is that helping me in a crisis? <laughs> you can stay warm. It's made of cotton. Oh, okay, <laughs> I get it. <laughs> Do you see how happy that guy is? This guy is definitely happy. He got this one. Okay, this is a buy. Four thousand people <laughs> bought it. Why? So someone asked, is there a difference between the $6 version and the $30 one? I don't see any more gold. The goal of the Three Wolf Moon shirt is to transcend <laughs> the physicality of the shirt and the money invested in it. Let your sweat and natural musk become the conduit from the shirt to you. Once you let go of all ties to anything except the wolves and the moon, you'll see that it never <laughs> to begin with. So yes, probably. Will this shirt's magic still work if I have three nipples? <laughs> Only three nipples? I mean, I'm working with four. Three might work. <laughs> All right, good to know, good to know. This guy wrote, you're, you're going to think I'm crazy, but when it came in, I actually heard the wolves in the far distance. When I actually put the shirt on, the hairs on my <laughs> arms stood up and I could hear my own heart beat. I was instantly hungry and ate three steaks raw. Afterwards, <laughs> I fell into sleep, into a deep sleep and was exposed to a crazy fever dream. I could hear warm drums at a chance of Native American warriors, they were calling me to come join them, to quench the thirst for blood, to wage war and unleash my animal instincts. I awoke to a massive... <laughs> 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 that lasted for days. I haven't put the shirt on since. <laughs> it's in a box that's inside of a box. That's inside of a box that's inside of a closet, that's inside of a room, that's inside of a basement, that's inside of a house, that's inside of a neighborhood that I don't visit anymore. I can still hear it calling to me. <laughs> Only buy this shirt if you think you can handle it. I'm done for today. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that is a quick cop in my books. I think that's all it took for me to be sure that this was the best buy of the day. It's a fire stuff. It looks like a dynamite stick. <laughs> so you have a fire starter with an integrated high decibel emergency whistle and nine feet of braided survivor cord. It looks really high quality. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Look at that. He starts a fire with this. Oh, damn. Yeah, I like that. How much is that? 25 bucks. I wonder how long it lasts though. You can't just keep scratching it, right? Uh, oh, it is designed to spark more than 12,000 times. I think you're oh, fine, man. Oh, shoot. <laughs> if you're in a survival position 12,000 times, I don't think the problem is this. I think the problem is whatever <laughs> your lifestyle is. Wait, this is crazy. So the paracord itself actually has things inside of it. Too. Fishing Lines. line, some fire tinder, some metal wire for something, and, and then paracord actually. So would you guys buy this? I feel like we've been buying everything. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, like, I want to say drop on something, but you actually picked pretty cool stuff. So, yeah, I think I would also buy this one. Yeah, we just have infinite money here. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> like, <laughs> yo, it's currently unavailable. It's sold out. Can you tell me how Milk has, like, only three star ratings? <laughs> because it probably comes to your house in a warm shipping container and it tastes disgusting. <laughs> 1,630 people bought whole milk. Wait, how is it sold out? You think it's because of like the current situation? This is, this is dumb. <laughs> Yo, someone asked, if I spill it, can I cry? And he got 300 votes and, and the answer is, but I think your milk is still price protected if you spill it within <laughs> within seven days of purchase. I recommend the extended warranty in this case. <laughs> Dude, I see that they sell used and new. How can you sell used milk? <laughs> like this guy's like, you pour whatever is left over from cookie cereal and chocolate milk back into the bottle. <laughs> Add some of the uranium that you can get from Amazon and it magically fills itself back up. <laughs> K. Hughes says it's not compatible with iOS 7. 
<laughs> this product severely damaged my iPhone when I immersed it. Let's see how much it was sold at when it was in stock. Three, two, one, boom. In June 2010, it went up to $557 and then it went back down to its regular price, which was around $75. And the highest it was sold for was $2,500. That's yeah. actually stupid. Would you guys be willing to pay upwards of $2,500 for this legendary milk? I would never buy milk online, I'm sorry. I would personally buy $2,500 milk. It had gold in it. Oh, is that an iPhone case? It is an iPhone case that protects your phone and extends life of battery. And it's a gun. It's a stun gun. Wait, it's a stun gun? Holy crap! It actually thing. works. <laughs> You're making a phone call, you actually stun yourself? <laughs> And those little like metal, what is it? What is it called? The prongs or whatever? There's a slider on it so you can extend them whenever you, you're ready to stun someone. Is that illegal? Oh my illegal? god, you actually see the electric though. Is it called a yellow jacket because it's supposed to sting like a wasp? Oh! Oh, yeah. 86% yeah. <laughs> of people who are assaulted and respond with fierce physical force escape unharmed or with minimal injury. Fight back and survive. Very, very serious stuff here. Well, honestly, I, I don't know what to think. I didn't even know this thing existed. Gotta stay safe. Like, if anyone tries to cough on you, you pull out your phone. <laughs> I, I think it's overkill, man. Like, I think it's too much. So, uh, is it a buy or a pass? It's a pass for me. I think it's cool. I will buy that one. Oh, baby, there it is. A portable <laughs> bed day. Bad as a cop. I don't need to read much further. Add the cart real quick. <laughs> Yo, this is disgusting, man. Man, why do they advertise it as a childbirth cleaner? In desperate times, calls for desperate measures. So if you're running out of toilet paper, for only... <laughs> For $29, for only $29, you have unlimited toilet paper for the rest of your life. Angled spray for perfect aim. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? That's how you use it. Ergonomically designed for optimum hygiene and perfect aim. Oh my god. Th this is a cop. There's no there's no doubt about it. Would you rather pay $50 for toilet paper? Bro, the the uh, the spray is actually pretty strong. Look at his video. Oh yeah, that's a maximum spray right there. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, why does the water like curl up? It doesn't shoot and it's not like when he lets go, it sprays up a bit. You're gonna feel, you're gonna feel a tingling sensation. <laughs> <laughs> they write larger is better, bigger nozzle, and 17 ounces or 500 milliliter extra capacity soft squeeze bottle. Seven nozzle hole ensures stronger pressure and of water and a wider area of cleaning. So if you ever use a real bidet, well, the portable bidet would be just as good. And in times of crisis, I think this is a cop. It says, save the toilet paper. I feel this ad was made way before the crisis. But... Save the toilet paper. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What are both your final thoughts? I would get the, the big boy. The but the larger, the larger is better. At 28, it's an absolute... For... It's an absolute steal of a deal, and it's a cop. I would get two, I'd probably get two packs of two, I'd get four. <laughs> <laughs> you already have one, you're gonna get five in total? <laughs> yeah. Alright, Chase, you spent a lot more than last time. <laughs> Alright, hit it! You spent... 239 and 59 cents. That is a steal. In times of crisis, we must defend. Cashmere Premium 2-ply, are you ready? I am. You spent $111.60. See, this is a lucky number right there. 111. So you know I did the right choice. You know what? Cashmere 2-ply is going to run out of 2-ply and he's going to have to use that money anyway. All right. Well, thank you guys for being on another episode. All right. What are we doing next? What is the next episode? Let us know if there are any other cool bidets. We'll just get them for Jason and that's it. We'll see you guys next time. Stay safe, my brothers. My brother. <laughs> <laughs>